Demoraz and Mesher made it their mission to find out. In a series of experiments, they placed wheat and tomato seedlings in the same pot and planted a newly sprouted daughter vine between them. Then they set up a time-lapse camera to see if the seedling was actually making a choice. For hours, it circles the air like a snake, as if sniffing out its victims. And nine times out of 10, its preferred victim is the juicy tomato, a tender plant that's easier to attach to. You really get the sense of a behavior response. So really, there is some fairly strong selection here for this plant to make the right decision, otherwise it will die. But how was the little stem making its choice? The team decided to play a hunch. They knew that all plants produce green leaf volatiles, chemical scents released by their leaves as they breathe. So maybe this predatory plant actually was sniffing out its victim. To test that theory, the team devised another experiment. First, they captured the scent of a tomato, essentially condensing the chemical odor released by the plant. Once it's distilled, they present the tomato perfume to the vine. Along with a real tomato, it can't possibly smell. Time after time, the daughter hones in on the chemical language that says, yes, I'm a tomato.